Hi, my name is Akiva Goldman. I'm the director and founder of Goldman & Associates. Our firm has a primary focus on family law. Please subscribe to our channels. What do you do if there's a custody order that gives you a custody of your child to your ex and you want to change that? Is there a way to do that? And the answer is, yes, there is. There is a very clear way. A motion for change of custody has to be filed with the same judge in the same court uh, that gave the original order. Uh, if that judge is no longer on the bench, his or her successor will entertain that motion. But you file that motion, and in that motion, you have to explain to the court what the compelling uh, and significant change of circumstances has been that should cause the court to revisit the change in the first place. Remember one thing. It's not enough just to say, I want custody changed because I'm upset. I, I'm, I'm mad I lost custody, so I want, I want to change. You lost custody, you want to change, go file an appeal. That's what that's for. But if you've let that go, and now you just figured, you know what, enough's enough. Now it's my turn. That is not going to be enough to compel the court to even revisit the issue, let alone change it. The court enters a custody order, presumably, until such time as, as the kid turns 18, or until the circumstances have changed significantly to revisit the issue. So if you're going to want to change custody, number one, you're going to have to convince the court that something's going on. Something's going on that it constitutes a, a huge change in circumstances. Like what? Well, the kid's flunking out in school. That's a big one. Big change in circumstances. Uh, that's the kind of thing that could get the court to revisit the issue. Um, uh, the, my ex has become a drug addict. Well, that's a, a big one that would call, get the court's attention. Uh, my ex has become an alcoholic. My ex, uh, ex has gone on a life of crime. There are felons in the house all the time. The kids have access to guns. Um, it's not a safe living environment. These are all things that the court can say, well, wait a minute. When I made the order of custody, that didn't exist. Now it does. Now I have to rethink whether or not I still want that mom to have those kids. That kind of thing. So that's what's involved. The court has to do that, and you can... Set that mechanism in motion by having a motion for change of custody filed. If you have any questions about that, reach out and we'll be glad to help you out.